I was just a 10 year old little girl and the year was 1950. It was a simple time when families would sit together and have dinner, kids could play safely in their own yard without fear and dads went to work while mom stayed home and took care of everything. Our family was no different. Breakfast time had always been my favorite time of day. That is until one fateful morning. Every morning as far back as I can remember, mom would cook breakfast. The sound of bacon frying in the pan and the smell of coffee brewing can still take me back there today. The best part of those mornings though was when Uncle Dutch would come a knocking. He wasn't really my uncle, but being my dad's best friend and business partner made him family. Uncle Dutch was the best. He told the funniest jokes and recited the most wonderful stories. I loved to just sit at the table while he sipped his coffee and listen to him talk. Every morning, I would look out the window waiting to see Uncle Dutch walking down the drive. As soon as I would see him, I would run to the door. He always had to give his special little knock, and I would tell him, please come in. He would then swing open the door and in his loud, beautiful voice say, Good morning, my favorite family. It was the best. One morning, that started out just like all the others. I found myself looking out the window watching for Uncle Dutch. And just like any other, I watched as he came walking down the drive. I ran to the door and waited. Then there it was, his special little knock. But just as he knocked, the phone rang. After I told him to please come in, I heard my mom answer the phone with her usual sing-song hello. After a moment or two, I noticed the door had not swung open. So I again, but this time a little louder, said, Please come in. I remember thinking that maybe he didn't hear me. Then from behind me, I heard my mom cry out, Oh my lord, no. As I turned toward her, I listened as she told my dad that Dutch had a heart attack early this morning and died on the way to the hospital. Shocked by what I had just heard and very confused, I quickly opened the door. Nobody was there. Later that day, my mom and dad and little brother all admitted they heard the knock too. Seeing the fear on my face, my father took both my hands and said to me with a tear in his eye, please don't be scared. It was just Dutch coming over for one last visit and to say goodbye. <laughs> 